today I'm off to Donington because we are going to the British Touring Car Championship as we're going to record a bunch of stuff for the next iPlayer show, which is about like my favourite racing games of all time. So it's going to be good. I'm going to see some real people who can actually drive really well as opposed to me who just thinks that I can drive really well and terrifies my passengers. So I've arrived in Donington, I just need to find my guy. Oh look, there's a traffic there. Uh, uh, yeah, and then we're gonna go and uh, chat to people from the British Touring Car Championships about how awesome it is to be uh, a race car driver, because I assume it'd be awesome. Video games have told me that it would be awesome. You know, sun, sea, sand, sangria, strippers maybe, I don't know. I can't see any strippers yet. Let's find out. See, even on like a really gloomy day, it just looks really cool going on a long road, walking slowly with matching jackets. Oh my God, they're sponsored by Tuba Tubes. Where's the free lollipops? Oh my God. Question, if I was a racing car driver, who would I be sponsored by? Uh, Marmite, probably. Marmite and some kind of coffee company, let's be honest. There's also an assortment of snacks and drinks. I'm really hungry now. I ate my bacon burger. I should not have done that. So the only other times I've been here is for Download Festival uh, when I used to work for Rockworld. And yeah, it's very hard to determine where you are, what's going on when you're not surrounded by drunk people. One of which is also you. It looks very different, but that's obviously, it's just like a plain space, of course it's going to look different. <gasps> Beef burgers, pims and prosecco, why have I not been to racing things before? There's booze and food, who knew? Golf carts, look, British touring car, look, you get your own car. There's a place that has prosecco over there, that's where I'm going later. That will be my treat for working on an Easter weekend. <gasps> I don't know why I'm so excited, obviously there are going to be cars everywhere. Car. I'm going to be like a small child, like a car, car, bus, car. <laughs> of course it's cars. There's going to be cars everywhere. That's like literally, literally the point. So many trucks. It's like Smokey and the Bandit. But with less Burt Reynolds. I need to watch some movies that aren't from the past one day. Dunlop Cafe welcomes invited guests. Invited guests only. I riff raff bugger off. Everyone has buggies. Shredded wheat. It's quite. I thought that was an actual person, but actually it's just a stuffed toilet. It's literally a truck of tyres. Literally the most amount of tyres I've ever seen. So, how, how are you? you? Good, thanks. How are you? Good. So, I'm vlogging. This is it. This is it? Yeah. Cool. Upstairs, yeah. I hope it's uh, warmer. You good? Good, the. Um... Mass effect Yeah, the president's office. <gasps> Race control. Just keep filming people. Clark of the Court Kitchen, obviously. <laughs> Race control. Oh, no, Paul, Julia. Cleaners get their own room as well. What? Alex, what are we doing today? We're filming at Donington uh, Racetrack. Yeah. Um, and we're trying to get an intro for this new Mario Kart uh, countdown top five racing games of all time gaming show episode. Wow, you should be a <laughs> presenter. That was super succinct and to the point. <laughs> oh, oh, zoom out, man. No, oh, there no, we go. Look, my, no, look. For some reason, my necklace is doing yeah. some weird stuff. What does that mean? Is it like it one just of... means you're in focus. It's good. Don't okay, worry. Good. No one will see that. So here I am. Look. It's just like from the video game. There's like roads and cars and stuff. <laughs> it's actually really cool. I need to stop being really excited every time a fast car goes by. I'm like, car, car, look. Car, car, car. I'm gonna have a really, really stiff neck by the end of today. <gasps> look, what's that? Ah, oh, what? I thought it was gonna be something bigger, but it's not. It also made the terrible error of jacket judgment this morning, and I'm now so cold. <laughs> it's 
crazy, look. They let me, they're gonna let me drive them. They'll let me drive them. No, they won't. Uh, the thing is, I like to think, video games have made me think that I'm like a super amazing uh, driver. And I think the reality is that perhaps I'm not. I just like to think I am, and I like to accelerate really quickly and be annoying and upset for people in the car with me. I'm so cold, I can't even explain. I didn't even bring some gloves or a hat. I'm literally in a denim jacket. I'm also really excited they've given me a high-vis jacket, mainly because I feel like it will provide extra warmth. I'm gonna do that all day, like a complete war. Is that how they get them going? Jeez. How's your uh, pulled pork sandwich and garage music oh, yeah. going down? <laughs> yeah? It's got stuffing in it as well. It's quite There's nice. stuffing in it yeah. as well? <laughs> what? It's pretty good. That looks amazing. You know what's good about that sandwich is that the meat to bread ratio is correct, as in it like there's good. way more meat than Jack. there is bread. It's liberal with the meat, help me. <laughs> shredded wheat yeah. do you really can I have some okay so here's a question uh, if you are involved in racing or you know other sports that have kind of like branded sponsors and stuff like that like if you're a bit of a freeloader and a blagger asking for a friend would you um, make friends with different teams depending on what you needed that day like one of the teams is sponsored by shredded wheat so like you go hang out have breakfast with them and then maybe like they're sponsored by I don't know um, some kind of like really cool I don't know tire company holiday firm stroke insurance company and then you just chat to them when you want some of that stuff is that how it works I don't know, well, there's just some cool guys in here. Whee! And you're just friends with them because they're awesome and they have like a golf cart and you already want to go in it. I'm so really perplexed by this thing, they're like weighing it. Is that what they're doing? Weighing it? I'm coming to realise I know little to nothing about racing as a sport. If I play a game, I will uh, never really go that in depth. I will just keep it really, really simple and I'll go like with auto like default options because I don't know. As long as I can just go around and drive like an idiot, then it's win, win, win. This is cool. Isn't it cool being on the track? Look, now all I need to do is convince someone to let me drive one of the cars and uh, yeah, it'll be a wonderful day for 10 minutes until I crash it. Uh, what's the best thing about uh, working in racing? Best thing about working in racing is the yeah. fact that as a racing fan, I get to be a race circuit every single day watching cars and bikes yeah. um, fly by my window. Is it as glamorous as people think it is? Um, what are the glamorous bits and what are the unglamorous bits? Glamorous bits, really. It, it really depends on the nature of the weekend. I mean, yeah. um, for me, I do a lot of the sort of behind the scenes things, so yeah. I don't really see the glamour side as much as other people would do no. in hospitality and that sort of thing. But, um, no, no strip clubs and steaks? Absolutely not, no. no. My girlfriend would kill me. <laughs> oh, okay. Just the steaks then? Uh, whatever I can get. Cool, look, number plates. If you're going to have a number plate, it should be something cool like that. It looks really flash. Yes. That's like ridiculous. Number plate. It just needs a Y! And then it'll be perfect! This is his car, I'm not too sure where he actually is. How are you? I'm yeah, vlogging. Okay. How's it going? <laughs> yeah, really good, thank you very much. So, uh, what is the most glamorous thing about being uh, involved in the racing team? Is there, a, is there anything glamorous about it? Uh, I could lie and say yes. <laughs> There's a lot of hard work that goes into it, unfortunately, so... Um, That's, you're not selling the dream I'm to not, me, man. I'm not, sorry, no. I, I'm absolutely not, no. No crazy parties? Well, there's crazy parties, yeah, but it's... Uh, it's How crazy? What's the craziest thing that's ever happened? I uh, don't know. Someone's driven a car off a 
into a swimming pool. I yeah, don't know. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. Let, yeah. yeah. Did let's that happen? Let's, let's create a complete false impression of it. Yeah, that's exactly what's happening. Excellent. Megan. You know, you spend all this time building the cars and then you drive them in a yeah, swimming pool. Yeah, drive them into swimming Sorry, I don't get to do really awesome things. Oh. Look. Hey. 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 How are you doing? <laughs> I'm you're all right. good. You look like you're propositioning me on the street corner. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. I don't know how to take I'm just that. kidding, no, 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 it's fine. Uh, so we've been given a tour. Look, there's an IGN button should you need any video game news. But ah, also means okay. ignition. Ah. As you told me. That was too close, that was. That was quite close. I'll, close. I'll zoom back out. Yeah. She wants some. Ignore. Beep. Swipe left. Flash. Should you really like the person? <laughs> this is so cool, but there's like nothing. I mean, I knew this already, but I'm always surprised by how little, obviously, there is in the car. I'm too small for this car. You need to build me another one. <laughs> <laughs> and then the fuel bag. Bag? Yes, fuel bag, yeah. Fuel like bag tank, yeah. is back there, just so that if I crash, death. Yeah, quite death, but yeah, not far. <laughs> I mean, at least I would have to regrow my hair. Yeah, yeah okay. that's quite, yeah, at least minimum. Minimum regrow your hair. <laughs> this is really cool. Okay, what's the what's the best thing about doing this? Uh, this is pretty, pretty fucking awesome to be fair. So this is, uh, one of the things I love about this is the fans that we get. We get yeah. so many fans come and watch this. So yeah. Over this weekend, we race on Sunday. Yeah. So we'll have like 40 or 1,000 people that will come down and absolutely loving every second they come down. So you get all the fans coming out out the front for the autographs and, and everything else like that. So yeah, it's weird. Are you, are you kind of a big deal? <laughs> are you kind of a big deal, are you? Do you have uh, many leather bound books? Leather bound books? Sorry, I'm, I'm quoting Andrew Webb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I don't have <laughs> <laughs> this is really cool though. I mean, as jobs go, like, did you always know you wanted to do this? So I started um, in a go-kart when I was five years old. Oh man, so, you're like, like a career racer. Yeah. Is that your dad being like, come on now? Yeah, it wasn't pushy, but yeah, so my dad used to race like motocross, quads and all that kind of stuff. Um, and I was like five at a time, and so we're kind of sitting in carts and anything that had a motor and an engine on it really. Make all the noises and got cart for Christmas and it all just kind of took off from there really. So. Wow, yeah, and how, so how long have you been doing it professionally? Uh, at professional level probably now for the last four or five years. Are um, you a seasoned pro now? Well, no, I don't think that, but um, <laughs> it's, uh, I mean this is what's really cool about so the British touring cars, we've got some proper big names still in it, and Jason Plato, Matt Neal, and they've been they've been in it for like 25 odd years. So you they get a good been, long career out of oh, it, yeah, hey? Yeah, that's what's good about it, so you can uh, you can kind of stick with it for a hell of a long time. So in the grand scheme of things, I'm still one of the youngest, youngest drivers on the grid, so mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. What's more glamorous, Formula One or touring cars? <sighs> I ain't Formula One. <laughs> it's a Monaco and you go to all that fun stuff. Yeah. Wait, I'm in Whitstable next yeah, weekend. Yeah, we, we go to Darlington and it's not quite the same as Monaco. But hey, it's cool. <laughs> I really hope the touring cars is actually faster than that. So it is the end of my day here with the BBC at Doddington racetrack. Um, it's freezing. I still have uh, a hot drink, mainly just for keeping my hands warm. Um, it's been a really cool day, actually. I really love them um, being dropped into these sort of weird, not weird, but different slices of life that I would never normally see or know too much about it's like one of the coolest things about my job is i often just get this kind of glimmer into a completely different world or like somebody else's obsession and i just like meeting nerds of any kind it's really fascinating when you watch someone like be so passionate about things that they really love and things that they spend their time doing it's really infectious it makes me just want to do all the things that they're doing because they look so happy and engaged with their life. So yeah, it's been a really nice day. I kind of want me to be a racing car driver now. Can I? But I'm quite tired and quite cold now. I'm going to be run over by this car now while I'm minding a tripod now. So I'm going to stop talking and I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. If you do, let me know what kind of weird things you'd like me to do next in like the comments below and I'll do them and I'm being weirded out. Violet yellow, hi! I have no idea they are. They're just, 
I don't think they have vloggers around here. They don't have vloggers really anywhere. I just get stared at wherever I go, basically. I've lost my camera guy. He's gone up the track now. Okay. Um, yeah, don't forget to hit me up in the comments and let me know the places you'd like me to go or vlogs that I haven't done that I should do and I will consider it. <laughs> All right, thank you for watching. Seriously, it's been a riot and I will see you next time. Right, let's get out of here. Time to go home. Yeah. Say bye to everyone on the internet. Bye everyone.